V. Heard you had a gig for me. You heard right. I need a driver. So call a cab then. I don't like cabs. They have a bad habit of bolting when things get dicey. Listen, I'm a straight shooter, so let me cut right to the chase. I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not gonna get into the nuts and bolts, cause if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes, or are they wrong about you? All right, I'm in. Japantown, then. By the market entrance. Give a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, V. There's, uh, something on your face. The grenade. Can I ask why? You have a juggling accident or something? Not cool. You ask personal questions and yet you haven't even introduced yourself. You are V, correct? Yeah, that's me. Good. Then let's go. Where'd Sue? Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. What's that? You got grenades up your ass too?
Not bad, right? It would have been even better if you told me what you were planning from the get-go. <laughs> it's true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. Got a stick up your ass, though. This is where we part ways. Good luck, V. And, uh, relax a bit, okay? Now, are you gonna tell me about the grenade? Oh, that. My brother ripped it off during a fight. With pliers. Ooh, one happy family. You don't know the half of it. I could have chipped another one, but... I don't know. I think this matches my style more. Uh-huh. Besides, it's a real icebreaker with the ladies. Got me powder for my nose. <laughs> and, does it work? Not really. What about my payment? What about it? Here, like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. And hey, keep your nose to the ground.